Damage was caused to homes in a Palestinian village in the Israeli-occupied West Bank on Tuesday after what appeared to be a rocket launched from Lebanon landed nearby. Of course it was in the morning and most people were asleep or preparing students for school, said Shukba resident Sami the Bet. The Israeli military said one projectile was fired from Lebanon and fell in an open area early Tuesday following an air raid siren in Modian Ilit settlement in the West Bank. This comes as Israel stepped up its strikes in Lebanon, targeting a Hezbollah-run financial institution, and as Israeli troops pushed ahead in their invasion of southern Lebanon. The military said it aims to push Hezbollah out of southern Lebanon so that tens of thousands of Israelis can return to their homes nearby after more than a year of cross-border rocket and drone attacks. Hezbollah has been launching rockets into Israel nearly every day since Hamas' deadly raid into Israel last year that sparked the war in Gaza. فجأنا الصبح إنه نزل صاروخ في هذا المكان في قرية شكبة كان صوته قوي قوي جدا وهذا الصاروخ أجا بعد صفارات إنذار قوية سمعناها طبعا كان الوقت صباحا ومعظم الناس نايمين أو بتجهزوا الطلاب للمدارس وأحدث خوف كثير بين بين الأهالي في قرية شكبة وأحدث أضرار يعني في الأراضي الزراعية وفي المنازل والشبابيك. The Israeli military said Sunday it had struck more than 100 military targets in the last day belonging to Hezbollah in southern Lebanon. The army released footage said to show airstrikes on the Hezbollah targets in the area of al Mura. Israel has meanwhile ramped up strikes on the southern neighborhood of Beirut known as the Dahia, a crowded residential area. Hezbollah has a strong presence there but it is also home to large numbers of civilians and people unaffiliated with the Lebanese militant group. A year of escalating tensions boiled over into all-out war last month. Israel sent ground troops into Lebanon at the start of October. Israel's war against Hezbollah, the Iran-backed militant group, stretches far inside Lebanon, and its airstrikes in recent weeks have killed more than 1,700 people, about a quarter of whom were women and children, according to local health authorities. Some of the more than 50 Israelis killed by Hezbollah over the past year were hit by anti-tank missiles. The Israeli military said Sunday that more than 170 rockets were launched from Lebanon at northern Israel.
seven people were injured in Zaporizhia as a result of a Russian strike on Monday. More than 30 residential buildings were damaged, according to the regional governor Ivan Fedorov. Another Russian strike on Kiev also damaged a residential building, according to the state emergency service. 43 people were evacuated. Russia fired a barrage of three missiles and 116 Shahid drones, along with some UAVs of an unknown type, at Ukraine during the night from Sunday to Monday, the Air Force reported. 59 drones were destroyed. Gracias.